sneaking in his bed tonight. Another quiet one for you. Now tonight we've got light desktop. Not green desktop, light desktop. Now the light desktop is for web only. So everything comes on the web, even though it's a 32 megabyte ISO. Wasn't too happy about that bit. So you have to sign up to add their servers or to their website, whatever it is. Put your username and password in and off we go. Now as you can see, it's not particularly fast. I've seen faster. But this is all we get anyway. Once you sign in, you get a light desktop, terminal, browser, don't you your screen, if your Wi-Fi or whatever. So anyway, let's go to light desktop, about QT, about light desktop, wireless config, applications install, log out to reboot and shut down. Yeah, it's alright, isn't it? It's alright. I've seen better. Bearing in mind, he's only just released this. He's just having a little play, I think. He wants to do a bit of geekery, as he says here on his home page. Because I've gone to here, look, as you can see. Opens up really slow, even though my net's not slow tonight. It's just really, 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 really slow. I'll go to Downloadery. And basically, he doesn't actually take it anywhere, basically. Because he's not got anything set up, really. He's only just put it up. So he's been having a play and having ideas and what have you. Which is all fine by me. But, if it don't work properly, it's no good, is it? Now, web-wise, on the actual browser, it's pretty, pretty quick. Yeah, pretty quick. Pretty quick, look. So I'll click on the BBC homepage. Eventually it does come up, but not as fast as if you've got an installed system. This is one problem I do have with it. Apart from a couple of others, that is. So, BBC page come up, all nice, that's fine, hunky-dory, it's alright, isn't it? You know? There's no different to any other page. It's why I'm, I'm trying to find something nice to say about it. But I can't, basically. It doesn't give me enough to talk about. Should I go quiet? No, I won't go quiet. Open the browser up. Same difference. No difference whatsoever. It is web-based. But everything has to be done by a terminal. So it seems, if you want any extra stuff. Right, the big problem I have with this... Is for simple reason. I'm just going to go to the ITV page by the way. The big problem I have with this is if you want to install something, you can get tiny core 30, uh, well, 11 megas now. Wow, you can get uh, a puppy pulp, which is really really small, which is around about 40 50 megs. You can get slight as at 40 to 50 is now, and everything's all installed and you get stuff to go with. Now, I know he's trying to use the cloud here and everything else, but it just isn't. Kicking it with me, basically. Plus, there's no flash. So, if you're webin webin centric, you really want to have flash installed as often, really, and it's just not doing it. So, for my 30 megs, I could have had a couple of other stuff, but not really. It's uh, quite depressing, really. I wasn't actually going to do this one, but I just wanted to give you a look at some of the stuff other people are actually doing at the moment. Now, he's probably got the right idea, he wants to use the cloud and everything. But it does need an awful lot more work before you try and put it up on the market or up on the cloud or on the web, whatever you want to call it. It's just not doing anything at all. You know what I mean? Plus you have to sign up as well. Bit of a bummer. Anyway, I'm depressed now. But yeah, mate, you're going to have to do a bit more work. Come back in about six months' time when you've got it all hunky-dory. Sneaky Linux going out. I'll see you later.